The Minneapolis Home and Garden Show is a welcome sign of spring in the middle or maybe toward the end of sure. our Minnesota winter. It's in full swing at the Minneapolis Convention Center. And one of the draws this year is Mike Rowe, creator of the show Dirty Jobs. And he joins us now. Good morning. Thanks for being with us. Hi, Mike. Hey, guys. Thanks for having me. I have a question. How do you find the jobs that you try out? Everything I did on that show yeah. and everything I do, everything, every, everything I've done ever since, honestly, has been programmed by the viewer. So people go to my Facebook page. They say, Mike, you got to come to Minnesota, get a load of this guy, wait till you meet her. And we go and the crew shows up and TV comes out the other end. Have it's you crazy. done any dirty job um, segments here in Minnesota, Mike? Oh, yeah. I came here. I think it was 2010, we flew into Fargo and, and drove over. And I met the guy who created the device that allows you to get the cars and trucks out of the lakes oh. that fall through the ice. Yeah, right? okay. And it's like this crazy trebuchet, and we suited up in dry suits and swam to the bottom of a lake with these giant bladders and rose a truck up as if by magic. And I, when I think about it, I'm still cold. All right, well, can you tell us a little bit about what you're going to be talking about today for folks that might want to come out there and hear you? Yeah, I mean, you know, it's the Home and Garden Show. It's a very big deal, and I partnered with the people who produce it a while ago because I have a foundation. It's called MicroWorks, and every year we try and give away a million dollars in work ethic scholarships. A lot of those scholarships are for trade skills, so we look specifically for people who want to learn a skill that's in demand. We get them trained and we put them to work. We've been doing it since 2008. And this is such a great place to meet uh, some of the people who are the potential employers of the people who go through my program. There's a huge shortage of skilled labor in the country right now, 7 million open jobs. So we try and make a persuasive case for good jobs that actually exist that don't require a four year degree. So I'm here in part to yeah. talk about that, mm -hmm. but mostly to tell some dirty job stories and have a few laughs with the locals. Yeah, the, I mean, the Twin Cities is sort of in a building boom right now. We know as well as anybody that it, we're building a little slower than we otherwise would because they literally can't find enough uh, tradesmen and, and laborers to do some of those jobs. What would you tell somebody, maybe the parent of a kid, uh, or what do you tell them uh, thinking about what to do leaving high school? Why consider a job in the trades besides the need? Because the path to prosperity is real. If you learn a skill that's actually in demand, you can go further and faster than anybody is telling you. So I spend a fair amount of my time debunking the stigmas and the stereotypes and the myths and the misperceptions that keep people out of these trades. We just try and make a persuasive case for the opportunities that exist and then show the parents and the guidance counselors and the kids how it works. It's not complicated, mm -hmm. uh, but av having done it now for 10 years, we've got a fairly persuasive body of evidence and uh, it's fun to share that with people. Incredible, yeah, we have Dunwoody College right sure. here, yep. which is a, a great school. And so, Mike, thanks so much for your time yeah. this morning. If you want to meet Mike Rowe, uh, there's a meet and greet at 1130 until 1230 in Hall B at the Minneapolis Convention Center. The Minneapolis Home and Garden Show runs today from 10 until 9. Tickets are $14 at the door. Kids age 6 to 12 are $4. All right. Thank you.